Chef Freddy here, Fantasy Springs Resort Casino, with my tip of the week. This week, I'm going to show you how to make the best ground beef, and you do it yourself with 100% pure chuck, which you can get at the grocery store. Just ask your butcher for it. The idea is to dice it into one quarter inch pieces and put it in the freezer for about an hour. You need this to be cold because we're going to use an ordinary food processor. Very few people have a grinder, something that the butcher would use or a supermarket would use to grind meat with. But as long as you dice it and you put it, make it very cold, almost halfway frozen, you're just going to put it in about maybe a half pound at a time. And we're going to pulse. A regular food processor works. You can check it every, every few pulses. I brought mine from home and can check it every, every few pulses to see if it's the texture that we want. Then we're going to form awesome hamburger patties and make the greatest burger ever. Another thing when you're forming a hamburger patty is to not compress it too hard. Just get it together just lightly, okay? That's okay if it's a little misshapen. But don't smash it really hard. You're going to see that's another th reason why. Sometimes if you taste a burger, sometimes it's like really firm and rubbery. It's because that I compressed too much. A lot of machine-made burger patties out there. Probably some of your favorite restaurants are using them. But a nice hand-formed patty, like we do here at our restaurants at Fantasy Springs, you're going to taste the difference because it's hand-formed, all of them. No fancy seasoning. Just a little kosher salt and pepper. Another little tip here is when you are doing a burger, try to cook it on both sides, but only flip it once. That way all the juices stay in. And there you go. The perfect burger made with your personal homemade ground beef. I'm Chef Freddy at Fantasy Springs Resort Casino, and I'll see you next week. Forget about it.